Zelda Williams is denying a viral post about her father, Robin Williams. On Sunday, August 11, the actress and director, 35, refuted a post claiming that the late actor had a pet monkey. Her response was shared on the 10th anniversary of Robin's death. The original post, shared on X, formerly Twitter, on August 10, displayed a photo of Robin posing with a monkey on his shoulder with the caption, one of the last photos of a gem of a man with his pet monkey taken a few days before he committed suicide by hanging at the age of 63. Zelda reshared the post, writing in response, it's been brought to my attention some probably AI-written BS like this is going viral. Dan didn't own a pet monkey, no one should, and if you're ever tempted to, support your local exotic animal rescues instead. That is his night at the museum co-star, who now lives at one, she then confirmed, referring to Crystal the monkey who played Dexter in the Night at the Museum franchise, in which Robin starred. Zelda also cleared up in the comments section of her post that the photo of her father is a real picture, noting, it's just not the last picture. Robin died by suicide in August 2014. The late actor shared Zelda and son Cody, 31, with his second wife, Marcia Garces, plus his older son, Zach, 40, with his first wife, Valerie Velarde. Zelda also spoke out about social media posts regarding her father on the anniversary of his death on August 11 in a follow-up post. Since more completely false or badly researched posts are likely to go viral on dad's death anniversary, maybe just assume they're all BS, they usually are. I sure as hell will, she said. Back in December, Zelda opened up to Pete Bell about her fond memories of her father, making it a priority to be with his family so they could make traditions together amid the holidays. Being together was the important thing because otherwise, especially with people scattered to the wind with work, it became even more special to do that, Zelda explained. Dad's job made it pretty hard to keep anything like a yearly tradition really, aside from Thanksgiving or days when sets would shut down," she continued. So we didn't really have much in the way of that, but cooking together was a big part of our family. We would eat together every Tuesday, however many family members were in town. 